If this is the first time you've used the app on site, you'll need to do an alignment. So we start that out with this rough alignment using the dollhouse. You can turn that on in the menu right here. So uh, this is the rough alignment. So first we just want to get it basically facing the right direction. And then you can grab this box and place it about where you're standing. Now at this point you should be close enough that you can see the physical lined up with the digital and confirm that you're about in the right spot. And we can go into the alignment menu in order to fine tune it. So we can see that this is not set and it's giving you the hint to use rough alignment and then adjust for precision. So we're going to set an anchor. Walk that over here to the column grid. It's good to use authoritative points. I'm actually going to use the corner of this so that I can really look carefully at it. Something like a column grid, a slab edge, or if you've included in your model even uh, survey points, then make sure you confirm it. Now you're going to want to walk to another spot to do a second anchor. It's good to have something that is a ways away, um, but still within view of your first point. Uh, that helps the precision of uh, rotation be a lot tighter. So we're going to set anchor again and follow that same procedure. Look at it from a few angles and confirm. Now we can see that alignment is set to active and we walk to improve data.